On Christmas Eve 1944, San Francisco Ballet performed America's first complete production of Nutcracker, choreographed by Willem Christensen. We had no idea that we were making history, but it turns out that we were because we were the first uh, full-length Nutcracker ever done in America. Successive performances of Nutcracker were then held across Northern California, giving the country its first taste of Nutcracker fever. In 1954, a brand new production under the direction of Lou Christensen premiered. And by 1967, San Francisco Ballet had produced three versions of the now hugely popular ballet. All across the country, versions were popping up by small and large ballet companies alike. Nutcracker had become an annual American tradition. In 1986, San Francisco Ballet premiered its fourth version of Nutcracker. This production included choreography from Lou Christensen's 1967 ballet, with additions by Willem Christensen and the company's current artistic director, Helgi Thomason. Eighteen years later, Thomason conceived a whole new version of the ballet, and in 2004 premiered a stunning new production. Set in one of the city's iconic painted ladies, it is a distinctly San Francisco affair. San Francisco is the most beautiful city in America. It made sense to place it in San Francisco. This was the first performance ever done of Nutcracker in this country. And it celebrates that. What Marty Paclodinas did with the costumes and scenic elements of the city is just beautiful. In a way, I can say truly to the San Franciscans, this is your production. This is your Nutcracker.